Hey Trevor fam, welcome back to another video. Now the concept for this video is that I have this here toy trumpet, which many of you may have seen I used on this video right here, the $3,000 versus $13 trumpet. Now, I bought this thinking that it was an actual trumpet, and if you've seen that video, you know it's obviously not. It's a toy trumpet that sounds like a flute, sounds like this. Uh, yeah, kind of weird, almost like a recorder. But anyways, I had this fun idea. I was like, man, I already have this toy trumpet, so let's try and do something fun with it. So I thought, let's try and make a beat out of this trumpet, okay? Um, I've been learning Ableton and how to make beats and produce music and stuff like that, so I thought it'd be kind of fun. So I started to make this beat, and it turned into basically an entire song. So the original beat that we came up with sounds like this. And then that repeats through the whole song. And as you'll see in a minute, I'll show you how I ended up creating the beat for this song. And then uh, basically it turned into an entire song with a rap and everything just because it was kind of fun to do. Uh, so with that said, here's an explanation of how this whole song was made. And then at the end of this video, if you stick around, um, you'll hear what the whole sound sounds like. Let me know in the comments if you like the song and make sure to leave a like rating uh, if you enjoyed it. Um, I'd love to do more videos like this in the future if you enjoy them. Uh, so here you go. All right, so welcome to the full project of the song Toy Trumpet, which I wrote with my brother. As I discussed before, we started this whole song off by recording a beat using the toy trumpet that I have used in a previous video of mine. The original purpose of this video was just to create a beat um, using the toy trumpet because I thought it would be a fun challenge, especially since the toy trumpet sounds pretty awful. Um, so it would just be a fun challenge to create a beat around it. Once we created the beat, uh, basically, we ended up making a whole song out of it uh, just because it was fun and yeah, that's just what ended up happening. So as you heard before, we have the original beat that we made with the toy trumpet sounds like this. Yeah, so as you can hear, uh, basically the trumpet, the toy trumpet just repeats throughout the whole song as the beat. Um, yeah, that's just how beats work, and we're using this as the main kind of melody in the beat. Now, I know, and I'm going to get comments on this, the toy trumpet does not sound good, and I'm well aware of this. I, uh, in my defense, it is a toy trumpet that costs $13, and it's only got four notes, so it's got an E, A, a C sharp, and then high E, um, which don't sound great. Now, I'm sure if I put a lot of work into the audio editing, I could make it sound great. I'm not going to lie, I really didn't want to put that kind of time into making this toy trumpet sound good. Uh, that wasn't really the point of this video, so instead I used kind of some other methods to make the beat as a whole sound good um, in total. So, the obviously the scale E, A, C sharp, uh, and then high E, which I actually got this wrong in the toy trumpet video, which I got a million comments about, so I get that, yes, is an A major scale. Uh, so that's kind of how I built this beat. I used an A major scale to build the beat around. So we have our synth, uh, 808, and then um, trumpet down the line are all in the key of A major. This is important, obviously, to keep your whole beat in the same key because otherwise it will sound bad. So let me just explain how I started to build the beat out for this song. So we started with um, just our um, toy trumpet and then on top of it, I added a, a wavetable MIDI. Um, this is just basically the same rhythm and notes as the toy trumpet. And the reason I did this is because, well, the toy trumpet doesn't sound great. So whenever the toy trumpet is playing, so is the wavetable. And I think it just makes it kind of sound better and fills out the sound a little bit more. Uh, the wavetable on its own sounds like this. Yeah, so as you can hear, it just repeats throughout the song, just like the toy trumpet. So then after that, uh, to build out the beat more, obviously we need some drums. So here we recorded this um, kind of trap beat, which sounds like this. It goes pretty well. So the song ended up kind of being a trap song simply because of the beat and the 808 that we have. and that repeats throughout the song as well. And then we have um, our 808. So 808's uh, definitely important in uh, trap 
songs, at least from my basic understanding. I'm obviously still a beginner at Ableton and producing music and something like that. Uh, don't take me as a professional at this in any means, but uh, we have our 808, which sounds like this, uh, which basically plays whenever the uh, drum beat plays and makes it just sound really good and uh, adds that low end to the sound. Yep, basically just like that repeats. And then finally we added on top this synth loop, which really adds um, that kind of background and fills out the whole sound completely. Uh, you'll hear when we play the whole beat that this synth loop is really what makes the sound, uh, in my opinion, sound really great. So um, this is what the synth loop sounds like alone. And this was a sample that I found. I did not record this one. Right, and so with all of these, obviously there's a lot of editing that went into it as well. So there's EQs and compressors put on all of these. Um, as you can see, if you look oh, down here, we have compressor, EQs, and such like that, um, which just kind of make them fit better together. So uh, different uh, wavelengths aren't mashing together, uh, certain things like that. So yeah, with all that said, um, we then have the full beat, which ends up sounding like this. So that obviously kind of completes the main purpose of this challenge video, which was to create a beat out of the toy trumpet. But after I created this beat, I was like, man, I can't just leave this video with just a beat. That'd be kind of lame. Uh, just be like, oh, that's the end of the video. There's a beat. I hope that was fun. So I was like, hey, I'll write some lyrics over the top. Okay, so I wrote some rap lyrics. They're totally ridiculous, honestly, like totally ridiculous. They have no meaning. And then my brother came down and he was like, hey, I want to write some lyrics, so he wrote some lyrics too, and we ended up basically writing this entire song and turning it into a rap song. We also created a chorus, which sounds like this. We used the trumpet. Sounds like this. Yeah, so basically we ended up creating an entire song and don't get me wrong we all understand that this song is a meme like it's very interesting the lyrics do not actually fit together at all so don't try and find any meaning from the lyrics because there really is none we just tried to create really cool rap flows and whatnot and just kind of use words that we thought were funny and whatnot so yeah don't try to take any meaning from this and i very much understand that uh this is a meme and it's uh, basically just funny so don't try and take it too seriously but the song is actually not too bad in my opinion and uh, with that said I'm now going to play the whole song for you um, here we go thought. They say rap is hard, but I'm proving it's easy. There's just something to it. It's called lemon squeezy. I'm spitting so hard, they gon' call me G-Easy, but I'm so damn good and I ain't even sleazy. I'm coming at you so hard, you won't even know what's hitting you. Underneath the seat, I got an AK brand new. You don't know what's happening, you'll be caught unaware. When you see me coming, you'll be pumped full of fear. Beat up and we'll hit the 
rap battle Obviously you'll be losing and you'll be so mad You'll rage quit like that 13 year old gamer You'll say I'm lame but I'll just say it lame Wanna know how I learned it? I learned it in band At the top of my game I'm the best of the land Shout out to Yas, Mr. Bell and them all They helped me to jump now I'm in a free fall I guess I need to finish this it's just too fire Anybody who says it's not is a goddamn liar I'll leave you alone before I put you in a hearse That'll bring us down to the very last verse Me on this beat, the trumpet guy I'm running every week with their musical supply I don't have a lot of knowledge I want to employ But I made this beat on a freaking toy Like for real on a freaking toy. This is all jokes. Don't flame me in the comments for this rap, okay? Thanks.